Kamala Harris is only on the ticket because she is a black woman. Well, I can say, no, I think it's maybe a little bit different. So uh, I've known her a long time indirectly, not directly very much. And she was always of Indian heritage and she was only promoting Indian heritage. I didn't know she was black until a number of years ago when she happened to turn black and now she wants to be known as black. So I don't know, is she Indian or is she black? She is always but identified you know as a black woman. I respect she went to a historically black college. I respect either one, but she obviously doesn't. Action. Well, well, it was all good. Just a week ago, the Democrats, y'all had Sleepy Joe, and then y'all gave him the boot. <laughs> Kicked him out the White House, said you gotta go like Uncle Phil. Now y'all want to bring out Kamala the Lion Llama. I have no idea why I called that woman a llama, but if she was to be an animal, she would be a llama. Dude, whenever you're dealing with conflict, pull out a Venn diagram. Kamala Harris, her favorite pastime is to lock up American men with black skin. There are black men in America right now talking about, I'm finna vote for Kamala the Llama. Okay, how many black men did she lock up? What were these black men doing? Do these black men represent me as a black man? I don't think she was kicking in the door of Christian churches and locking up young christian black men at bible study she was locking up criminals like that she did her job as a prosecutor i said man why would you do that i ain't no criminal kamala only locks up criminals well if you're a father in america the democratic party made it so that it's illegal to be a father in america they have reduced you down to a payment ever to serving a four-year sentence for felony non-support of a dependent that dependent his daughter Chantel, now 19 years old and if you don't make that payment then guess what you're a criminal what went wrong well uh getting locked up before didn't help any everett has been in and out of prison throughout his daughter's life for theft and receiving stolen property for a long time it's hard to find a job once you get a felony an american man with black skin running around her talking about i'm finna vote for kamala 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 Blue no matter who. That's how y'all sound. You sound ridiculous. You sound like Forrest Gump's little dumb cousin. <laughs> I don't think that I'm supposed to run behind any person and think that person is going to become a superhero. Kamala Harris is not going to turn into Captain Marvel. And Donald Trump is not going to turn into Captain America. Those are fictional characters. I live in reality. And these two people, they're not going to affect my life in a positive way whatsoever. And so how do American people get some for real power? I don't vote for politicians. I vote for policies. And so it doesn't matter who the candidate is you have to represent my ideology i want to abolish child support can you do that yes or no i want reparations for descendants of american slaves can you do that yes or no and if you can't do that then you gotta go the same way we gave sleepy joe the boot ah! <laughs> kick them right out the White House because in Fresh Prince they did live in a big ass White House and we give the American president this big ass White House while the American person sleeps in a fucking shack while the American person sleeps in an apartment that cost them $2,000 a month huh <laughs> while the American person ain't got no place to live the president sleeps in a white mansion and if he ain't finna do what I want him to do then he's got to go <laughs> That's the power of the American citizen. That's what it means to be a free person in America. I don't want nobody to give me nothing. No, that's that's not that's not true. Y'all took everything that y'all wanted to take from my people. My people. Y'all took everything I wanted to take from American slaves. And now descendants of American slaves are like, we want that back. Y'all know what y'all did. If you're a black person in America and you don't think that slavery affected your life in a negative way, then you must be the most, huh? I like the Democratic Party. <laughs> the only people who have real power in America are you the greatest american alive the most powerful citizens have ever existed in the history of the world why because you have the power to hold your elected officials accountable but instead of holding those people accountable you act like sheep why do you act like sheep everybody said i'm voting for sleepy joe i'm voting for sleepy joe and as soon as they gave that old man the boot they rolled out this Indian woman who's pretending to be a black woman. Everyone's like, you know Kamala Harris is Indian, right? It's like our <laughs> thing we're so excited about to have you running for president. Yeah. So we're both Indian, yes. but actually we're both South Indian. Yes, um, you look like the entire ha one half of my family. I thought democracy said that the American people, we get to choose our elected officials, but I didn't choose Kamala Harris to be the president of America. No. <laughs> No! I don't want that. You told me that I got to vote between an alley cat and a tramp. What are you talking about? You, you have the morals of an alley cat. Joe Biden called Donald Trump an alley cat and Kamala Harris, well, she's just a tramp. She's willing to do whomever to get 
wherever. And that's your politicians in America. They will say whatever and do whomever to whomever, whenever, wherever, at the expense of the American people. And I'm like, no. No. <laughs> no. I say, no, you can't do whatever you want to me. I'm a free person. I'll punch you in the eye, nigga. What's up? Does voting really matter that much? Because even though I vote, you still don't do what I want you to do. So, like, this isn't working. And I want something that works. I want my politicians to work for me. Don't you want your politicians to work for you? You want to clock in to work for 40 hours a week. And then when you get home, you get your paycheck. You pay all your bills. You ain't got no money. That means you're working for free. You can't feed yourself, clothe yourself, and house yourself in America on a 40-hour job and you want to talk to me about identity politics the identity of the majority of americans is a worker you are a worker <laughs> you clock in every day and you don't even have the time to process who you're voting for and so you just follow along with everyone else who says i'm going to vote this way you are a sheep and i'm like don't be no sheep if the system doesn't work then you do what the declaration of independence tells you to do you continue to fight for freedom your family is the most important institution in america but you you mad at your daddy why are you mad at your daddy because your mama said that he got a piece of cat on the side why can't i get some cat on the side side cat is good cat the biggest question in america is why am i voting america will give you candidate piece of shit a and piece of shit b and say choose between these two pieces of shit yeah 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 i don't want my elected officials to be no shit i want them to be good quality representatives for my ideology which is family church freedom all these things that make americans free you gotta love guns you gotta bang 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 you know niggas gotta turn the gat sideways. Gats are American freedom. If you can't defend your freedom, you ain't got no freedom. Once upon a time in America, black folks wasn't free, but hi, look at me. I'm free now. <laughs> the origin story of America ain't voting. The origin story of America isn't goddamn sexism, racism, white supremacy. That's not the origin story. The origin story of America is I'm trying to escape a king who was a tyrant upon my life. That's the origin story. It sucks to be a slave go ask my great great grandfather the greatest american alive the greatest american alive the greatest american alive the greatest american alive the greatest american alive